Hello everyone, it's Brett here, Lionheart84, and just a very short video today on the strange growth habits of several members of the Inona family. It doesn't seem to be all of them, but <clears throat> certainly this particular one's uh, an Atomoya Geffner, and I know my Cherimoyas are the same. The growth buds here, which incidentally on these you can see have got flower buds you can probably just about see they've got flower buds appearing on these new growth buds the growth buds of the side shoots on these are known as don't form in the leaf axle in the leaf axles so if I show a shoot that's got some branches on they don't actually have growth buds forming in the leaf axles at all the growth buds actually form underneath you can see there there's a leaf that's still on the growth buds actually form underneath the stalks of the existing leaves so for these uh, growth buds to come out here they actually the leaves actually have to fall off or be pulled off or naturally drop off the plants so it's a very strange habit as you can see at the end here there's no there's no growth bud in there whatsoever, but you can see there the new buds forming where the leaves have fallen off. So it's a very strange growth habit. If you look at your citrus uh, or most other tropicals, you'll see new leaf, new growth buds forming in between the base of the leaf and the actual stem. But in the case of these, they uh, they don't grow until the leaves have fallen off and they they form underneath. So. Um, should be getting flowers as you can see on these because I think you can just see that nice and closely it has actually got flower buds this is quite a young grafted plant I've had this for a couple of years it's now up to about I suppose it's about four feet tall overall and it's starting to produce flower buds and it is only early March here so it's quite promising because it means that I could get flower buds flowers on it by about April the only problem I normally have with these is if they all open at the same time you can't cross pollinate each other you can't cross pollinate them because the uh, the male and female organs the flowers are, are ripe at a different time but it is what it is just have to be patient and hope that things uh, develop on them nicely but I just thought for anyone who wasn't familiar with and owners would be interested to see uh, where the actual growth buds develop from for the new shoots actually underneath where the existing leaves were attached I'm not sure what that style of growth is called technically in botany but um, nevertheless I find it very interesting so thanks everybody for watching please remember to give the video a thumbs up uh, obviously share share it with anyone you think interested please subscribe to my channel and remember if you hit the bell you'll be updated on new videos which will include hopefully the flowers opening on this uh, Atimoya Geffner at some time in the future catch up with you all soon Brett out for now